there, I'm Jade, and today I'm going to take you through a plaited style with a little bit of a knot at the back. The products I'm going to use are the Control Force hairspray, a little bit of the dry shampoo, and the hair's already been prepped with the volume prep. If you, if you click on the screen, it'll take you to that preparation technique. So let's get started. So we're going to start on this side of the hair, in fact I'm going to part it on a bit of a zigzag section so it's not neat. We don't want a really sharp line. We're going to pin that out of the way and then we're going to move on to this side. So I'm just going to use a normal French braiding technique. So split that into three and then we're gonna go from the outsides in. And then add in from each side, braid the hair back. I'm not gonna do this too tight. I want a little bit of looseness so it adds a little bit of volume. It doesn't feel so scraped back for our guests. And I wanna pull it down. I want the shape to come around like that. tight so pulling it in there and then we're going to braid right down to the ends of the hair. You can even start to pull this out now if you feel that it's getting too tight as you braid further down. So we're going to keep going, keep going. point where that's a bit shorter and the others are still a bit thicker, just take a bit of hair over into that section and just carry on braiding because you want to get as low down to the bottom of the hair as possible. There we go. I'm going to use a little snag on the ends. It's going to just hold it tight. And we're going to move on to the other side. We've got both sides in now, and as you can see, you can't see the break in the middle. I'm going to go through and I'm going to pull this out a little bit more. So you want it nice and soft. I think hairdressers are quite scared of making it look messy. So I want this little bit of texture going on. I don't want it so neat and tidy. And it's great because I used the dry shampoo in the prep, so we prepped all the hair, then put the dry shampoo in, it's just given us that little bit more texture that I need. Now what we're going to do, we're going to use these together, so I'm going to wrap those around each other. I'm actually going to put a little pin in there to hold that together. That stays there, just means I've got no ends poking out and I'm going to wrap that around and just play around like see which looks best like does it look better turned under like that do you want to wrap it around it always works different for me i might try it one way and then i try it another way and it looks so much better so that to me feels about right because of the way the colors work in as well so i'm going to go through and pin that into place 
You don't need millions of grips in there. Make sure you can't see any of the pins. Cool. Like I say, pull that out a bit, give it a bit more texture if it needs it. A little bit of control for us to hold it in place. And there you go, really quick and easy plaited hair up, which is nice for any occasion. And if you like this video, please press like below. Also follow me on Instagram and we'll see you next time.